Hey everyone, welcome, I am Mr. Bo, and in today's video we're going to be going over all of the cheat codes that you can input in Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. Now if you enjoy the video, feel free to give the like button a big old hug, subscribe for more gaming content and coverage, and if you do, also boop that bell icon so you're notified when my future videos go live. So, just like the original game, Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled features a few different cheat codes that you can input in order to get different results. Now, I've already previously gone over one of the cheat codes, which will actually unlock you the secret character of Penta Penguin, and I will leave a link to that video in the description below. Now, in the original Crash Team Racing, you could input different various cheat codes in order to unlock some of the boss characters, characters like Entropy and Fake Crash. However, in Nitro Fueled, none of those cheat codes will work. You do need to unlock those characters in the legitimate way in either beating all of the bosses in adventure mode, beating the purple gem cup to unlock fake crash, and beating all of Entropy's times on all 31 tracks in order to unlock him. However, there are still some cheat codes that do work. So when you input one of these cheat codes, you'll get a message that pops up saying you have activated a cheat code, all achievements, Grand Prix challenges, and adventure rewards are disabled while you have a cheat code activated. In order to disable these, you need to select the adventure mode from the main menu. You then see a pop-up notification asking you if you'd like to deactivate these cheats. And if you click continue, the cheat will be deactivated. Now I'm going to go over all the different cheat codes and on screen you'll see the combination for all three platforms, so Xbox, PS4 and Switch, but I'll just go over the PS4 cheat codes, so if you do want to know the other ones, they will be on screen for you. So if you want to enable one lap races instead of the normal three, five or seven laps, you can hold down L1 and R1 on the menu and press down, up, down, down, right, up, down, right, triangle, down. If you want to activate icy tracks, which means the whole course is like you're racing on ice, then you can hold down L1 and R1 and press down, left, right, down, right, circle, triangle, down. If you want to have an infinite supply of Aku Aku or Uka Uka masks, you can again hold down L1 and R1 and this time press left, triangle, right, left, circle, right, down, down. For infinite bowling bombs, you need to hold down L1 and R1 and press triangle, right, down, right, up, triangle, left. For an infinite amount of Wampa Fruit for when you're racing, you can hold down L1 and R1 and press down, right, right, down, down. For permanent invisibility, again hold down L1 and R1 and press up, up, down, Right, right, up. For super engine mode, again hold down L1 and R1 and press up, up, left, right, triangle, down, right, down. For every turbo pad to become a super turbo pad, hold down L1 and R1 and press triangle, right, right, circle, left. And for unlimited turbos, hold down L1 and R1 and press triangle, X, right, left, left, triangle, X. And there you have it, those are all the currently known cheat codes that are in Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. These are all the exact same cheat codes from the original game from 1999. We don't know at the moment if there are any sort of brand new cheat codes, nothing's been discovered at this time, but if there is any new cheat codes to anything else in this game, I'll be sure to do an updated video for you guys, and I'll pin a comment down below if there is anything new that is found, telling you guys what those cheat codes are. So there you go, let me know what you guys think of these cheat codes, are you going to be popping them on, trying them out in some private matches. Again, this will disable any achievements that you can earn, any progress to the Grand Prix when those come out on July 3rd, and of course you can't use these online. So again, like at the beginning, if you enjoyed or if you found this helpful, feel free to give the like button a big old hug, subscribe for more gaming content and coverage, and boop that bell icon to be notified when my future uploads go live. But thanks for hanging out, and hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye.